Hi everybody, so excuse me if I'm whispering a little bit, but my husband's still sleeping. It's only, it's, yeah, it's like five something in the morning, and um, I've been on a staycation, and I've been working on this. It actually has taken me a while to do because I've been doing other things, but I just wanted to share the two new planners that are in the shop. They're going to be linked down below. I couldn't resist, um, first off, using my digital kit which I'll also link down below pastel Halloween and the material that I found a little while back at Hobby Lobby which is like another faux croc um, style of material and this right here I just got this from Hobby Lobby I think it's still half off because it's only today is only Friday so you still got a couple more days but I use it as is and it's the whole width here on here so I did sew it on and when I first got it I, I just thought of Halloween off the bat so um, anyway so I have these in the shop right now there's just the two they are a six size travelers notebook planners the inserts are four by six and again pretty much everything here I made myself including the inserts I printed out with another kit that I have I do have a small um, a6 insert kit with just has the lined lined paper insert the undated weekly and the undated monthly so just those three items which is normally what I put in here um, and again I didn't use everything in here but I, I did use a lot and I did make some stickers for you I did do the cutout cards and some tabs but not everything is in here because it's a lot <laughs> All right, so let me, um, they are exactly the same, except you could see the only difference is like the pattern of the material, you know, because when you cut it, you're going to get different things. Okay, that's my cat, if you can hear in the background. So let me just show you one because they're the same. I got some lavender elastic and I did make this dangle here I don't have much Halloween um, charms yet but I'm sure I'll get some later your spine is this sparkly glitter canvas material and FYI you know this elastic is going to want to like scratch on here or this is going to scratch the elastic but at least it's not completely all around there is a paperclip dangle down here as well and I have a lavender pen, which I think the tip, you have to remove the little plastic cover that it comes with. Mm -hmm. I did make three other paper clips. So you got four, actually, that I did. This is another paper clip. A pom-pom, a little witch hat, and then using the same material, a bow clip. I do have a tutorial on how to make this. I do have tutorials on how to make traveler's notebook covers, um, minus the sewing. I haven't done one with a spine yet. I have tutorials on making pretty much everything, including the shakers and the insert covers that are removable. So um, let me take this out because this didn't fit in any of the pockets, but these are stickers and they're tabs. So I haven't done mine yet because I actually made myself one and I meant to do the tabs, but this one's mine. Anyway, it's a sticker, so pull it out and it comes to two. And wherever you want to stick it, if you want to put it like say insert another sheet in here and then just stick it on you can have tabs either on the side or on the top so you're getting the five tabs that are in my kit and then these words too these are all stickers on here so I'm just gonna leave it whole I was gonna cut it but I'm like no I'll just leave it whole <clears throat> so then over here and you can see I used a gold lining which is also from Hobby Lobby uh oh, I think my cat is going down. Hold on. Okay, you guys. <laughs> so, where was I? Anyway, you're going to get two sheets. These are also stickers. Um, I just shrunk down everything and made some stickers from my kit that you could play with. And then here's just one of the cards. There's more. There's six cards in total. I just kind of set this up. Then here is the... Um, washi sample card which is in my kit as well you just print it out and laminate it 
So there's a few washi samples there, a little paper clip holding it. Um, is there anything in the back? Yeah. You're going to get a few of these little notepad sheets. I picked these up last year from Walmart. I don't know if they'll have any more this year, but... Alright, let's go back. And then you got your shaker, which you can always add a sticker. I didn't add anything to it, but I did use um, all the shaped pieces in there. The ones from the Dollar Tree that I recently got. And then just assorted other stuff. Then the first insert, which is this right here. The shaker always has that back pocket. And... I just use regular paper, not cardstock, for the covers, and it's single-sided. And then all the inserts are not attached to the cover, so you can change them out. There is a side-loading pocket here, the undated monthly. This time I made a, um, a vellum um, page marker, and this is also from my kit. Everything that you see here is from my kit, including the web. So instead of making a whole pocket, I used the web as a pocket. So I just laminated it all together. That's from my kit. Here's one of the cards and some of the images, the die cuts. And then the pen holder, which it's a fine tip, but you got to remove this white piece that's on there. Just so you know. And um, your dangle clip is on a black clip. The pom-pom is on a black clip. Okay, so then that pocket, that is from the shaker. Um, it's a pocket, plus I added an extra pocket in front of that. And inside, I just put in all the die cuts here, here. And then this is a sticker that I recently got on clearance at Hobby Lobby. You can put that, use some E6000 and remove the uh, that thing. And then stick it here if you like, or here, wherever you like. So, where was this? Okay, and then the die cuts, which I don't know if I'll get them all out, let's try, alright, so there's an extra sheet in there, which is, a um, that is made out of cardstock, okay, uh, is more, I feel like, anyway, so you get my little planner die cut. All of these I designed and doodled myself. Here's the little um, ghost, the cat, the spider, the vampire girl, the skulls, the cup, the coffin, that one, the witch in front of the, with and without the moon, this clip, the bat and the lips and there's a few more you'll see in a second like I showed you this planner this one and the boo pen okay and then the next one is this paper and some sticky notes this is the week on two pages here is your clip that I made using both that and a scrap of this material okay and then the folder looks like that and inside is an extra side loading side loading credit card pocket i think i'm going to change this out because there's a defect on here so i'll change that one out in this one but you will get one here's the other cards So I'm going to put this in front so I can remember. And then here is the last insert, which is a blank, not line, just the blank one. And the witch hat that I made with the black backing. And I think I, that was it. Yeah, that was it. Okay, so there were no more die cuts. <laughs> I thought I had some more, but they're all there together. Um, so... The die cuts are here. I think I already showed you. That's why I thought. All right, so that's pretty much it. It's linked down below. 
and I'm going to leave it open so I don't forget that I'm going to switch that out. But I'll show you this one. It's linked down below. Um, and thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye now.